boy, well that's something you don't photograph every day. Well, hello, good morning, and uh, welcome to an episode of Camilla and I. And today we're at RSPB Lodmore in Weymouth in the UK. Absolutely beautiful this morning. And the reason I came here today was particularly to see if the uh, turns had arrived yet for the new season. And uh, first of all, I saw plenty of goals, loads of goals. And then, um, yeah, sure enough, there were a few turns in amongst the goals, so it was a uh, delight to uh, see them back but the su first subject to uh, catch my photographic eye was the blacktail godwits um, just a pair of them um, I don't think it's male and female I think it was a male and um, juvenile male to be corrected in the comments below please and uh, yeah just uh, beautiful to see them fishing away quite close and um, it was great to get a few shots so uh, yeah, link to a few shots, a little bit of footage of the blacktail godwit and a couple of shots. Um, very, very nice. was that bird I saw on the way in this morning? Wow, it was quite a rarity. It was a water rail. Absolutely gorgeous. Amazing bit of luck to uh, get a water rail. Um, yeah, you don't see those very often. Quite a shy bird. I've seen some brilliant setup shots, but uh, the shots I've taken this morning, a couple of them linked now, are not set up. They're just in the channel. And unfortunately, they don't have a low angle. So, uh, not as good as uh, some of some former shots no doubt of water rails anyway still lovely subject to get and again quite a rarity god we're really doing the rarities on camilla and i at the moment absolutely superb well the next subject that caught my eye was a pair of uh, black-headed gulls fighting over a bit of weed and although the black-headed gull is quite a common subject there's an awful lot of them around here and um, it was amazing this fight carried on for about five minutes over a bit of weed oh it must have been a good bit of weed perhaps it was magic weed or something but anyway yeah well, i was able to get some great shots in flight shots of a fight over some weed ah. brilliant Yeah, so today on Camera and I we're shooting with the uh, Sony A1 and the uh, 600mm f4 and uh, basically we're shooting at 1 2000 to 2500th of a second to capture the birds in action in flight or whatever else they're doing on the ground. Absolutely amazing and of course we've still got the perch bird mode dropped to 1 500th of a second f5.6 at an instant and largely we're shooting wide open at f4 but if i see some interaction like this interaction between a couple of girls i'll then go to all oh, f 5.6 f 7.1 on the aperture just to get that greater depth of field so that we try and get both birds in focus 
So a little feature I started doing was uh, shot of the week. And um, I must admit that water rail could have been shot of the week because that is quite a rarity. And indeed that would normally be my shot of the week. But in fact, I got an even rarer bird than that in the week in the Woodford Valley. So uh, that's going to be my shot of the week. I don't think anything's going to beat that. But we will see. Anyway, I'll show you later on. Well, some even more amazing action on uh, Camilla and I this morning. Absolutely beautiful. Had some sandwich turns in and um, they were doing a bit of fishing. So, uh, yeah, linked to a bit of fishing and a few in-flight shots of uh, sandwich turn. Absolutely gorgeous. Great to see here. Beautiful. <laughs> Another amazing day at Lockmore. Absolutely beautiful. Great to see the turns are back. And uh, absolutely marvellous. Even had a fly past by the Marsh Harrier. So uh, yeah, linked to uh, Marsh Harrier fly past. There's one that usually goes up around 10 o'clock around here. Absolutely brilliant. thought I'd photographed a, a curlew and uh, indeed I got it half right it was a stone curlew it's the first time <laughs> it's another first it's the first time I've got a stone curlew over the Woodford Valley absolutely amazing so uh, it was a little bit far off it wouldn't make a calendar but uh, still incredible to get a stone curlew well another couple turned up and they were lucky to be afforded another fly pass by the uh, Marsh Harrier. Absolutely closest I think I've ever been to it here at uh, Lodmore. Absolutely amazing. God, it's brilliant. And this is all just from the pavilion. So uh, don't go anywhere else, just go to the pavilion. Absolutely superb. Sun at your back and uh, you can shoot all day. Well you can in this light. It's um, very nice this morning. It's quite just suppressed. It's just just got a little bit of soft box to it, although it is uh, essentially blue sky. So thanks for watching, have a good one, bye from Camilla and I.